How can we bring back commercial supersonic flight? Let's find out. Once upon a time, there was an airplane called the Concorde that could take you on a round trip from New York to Paris in three and a half hours one way, all for the low, low price of $79.95, 20 years ago. The Concorde was retired in 2003, mostly due to low passenger numbers and high maintenance costs. But the dream of commercial supersonic flight never really died. In fact, NASA has been working on bringing it back with the X-59 Quest, which stands for Quiet Supersonic Technology. The plane's design is intended to minimize the booms that are created by supersonic flight, hopefully to the point that they could fly over urban areas. NASA recently committed to a timeline that will see the X-59 take its first test flight in just three years. This will be the first piloted, full-scale X-plane in over 30 years. The X-59 will travel roughly 940 miles per hour at an altitude of 55,000 feet and produce a sonic thump that's about as loud as a car door closing. No word yet on the ticket price. Tell us what you think. Comment below, connect with us on Facebook, Twitter, or start a project board.